Uh, 50 is usually good enough. I learned from rewatching my failure last time so many times. Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Amber's Airline High Hopes Part 6. Oh, we're almost done with this area. How sad. <laughs> Try and find out what's inside Clark's baggage. I know we already looked at what everything is, but I always forget. So what even we're doing next time? I have no idea. Another scanner. Hey girl. Look at this one, super cute. I'm gonna go talk to him. Oh, that could be his wife right there. She's like a predator. Hi, it's a beautiful day, isn't it? Yes, it is. So where are you off to? Just traveling for work. Well, aren't you mysterious? I'm part of the flight crew, actually. You could always skip the long line and come through with me. No thanks, never liked the idea of being a VIP. Same. Seems like everyone is of equal importance, if you ask me. Wow, handsome and chivalrous too. What's the catch? I doubt I'm either of those, to be honest. It was nice meeting you. You didn't. I'm Pamela. Clark, nice to meet you, Pamela. Pamela, sorry, I don't even know. It could be either. What you got in there, sir? Sorry for the trouble. I do have permissions for these items. No problem. We just need to check through them before departure. Follow me. So who's that random lady? All right. Oh, I was about to say nothing to buy. Now there's nothing to buy rich okay let's stock try to find out what's inside clark's bag don't i have the right to look where's the music is it my computer oh girl mm -hmm. throw out your candy bars oh i should charge these yes of course grab this one why you need the fancy kind a lighter and an iPod. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, sir. My bad. Okay, Clark, when are you gonna call me, bro? Mm -hmm. I need to check your bag. Mm -hmm. Dude. Here you go, sir. Thank you. I'm the stock, stockity, stock, stock. And you're ready to go, and you should have no problems going through. Clark, if you ever want to call me over any time this century, I'd love it. <laughs> if the music wants to start, <laughs> I love it. Oh, he's calling me. Let's see what we got here. What is this? A pack of needles? They could be dangerous, sir. Well, I need them in order to administer antibiotics, you see. Why am I taking his word for it and not seeing official documentation? That's my question. <laughs> I wouldn't even, I'd be like, do you have something that says that you need to have these things? Especially because he said he wasn't even a good guy to her, like. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright, Mamadi Moo, where's the mouse also? Uh, 50 is usually good enough. I learned from rewatching my failure last time so many times. Go through, sir. I will check everyone out and the mouse was somewhere. Head on over, dude. All right, switch your junk. I really don't even have to try. <laughs> it, it just fits anyway. Just throw them anywhere. Mm -hmm. You packed up your stuff and you still have more stuff. Throw out your garbage. And then she's just gonna pass through. She's cleared for heart. Sir, are you ever gonna call me again? It's halfway through the day. Like, you're sitting here with needles. Thank you. I see a thermometer. I'll have to check if you can take that on an airplane. Well, I mean, that helps. It looks like medical supplies. He has the plus. Where is the mouse? Mouse? I do not see. Girl, you threw out stuff anyway. Your 
a mess. Why am I blind to this mouse? Oh, dude. She's gonna need to be checked as well. I'm on my way! 50. 50 isn't enough. It's stronger. You're hiding things deep in there. Alright. Goodbye, everyone. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Sir? Whenever I complain, he calls me over. So... Let's just keep up the complaints. Oh, here we go. See? Is that anesthetic? It is. Sometimes it's required for... For what? Crashing a plane? What's he up to? Let me search you, sir. Gloves make sense. A flashlight makes sense. I don't know about a magnifying glass. What could we possibly be using that to search for? <laughs> I don't know. Doesn't add up. Alright, we're killing it. We got the challenge. Everybody's going through smooth like. You're gonna need to be detained. I already know. Alright, let's see what we got. Pockets with the camera and keys. You really didn't think to take those out of your pockets? Have you never been in an airport before? Do you not know what a metal detector is? Question mark. Go ahead, love. She's gonna have to be detained. Is the day over already? Head on through, dear. I got you and grandma's good to go. Thank you. Both of you. Goodbye. I didn't get the mouse. I have no idea where he was. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Documentation. Here's my paperwork. I'm part of a medical team for a non-profit. Sorry for the hassle. Please feel free to give it the once over. Alright. Well, I guess it all looks in order to me. Sorry about that. Guess I should have known from the uniform. Not at all, you're just doing your job. Better to be safe than sorry. I've always admired doctors. I can't think of a more important profession. All jobs have value. Look at you, for example. You help keep people safe. Some folks don't exactly love us security people, though. All the more reason to give you respect. It's easy to do a job people love you for doing. Anyway, it was nice meeting you. Amber. Amber, what a pretty name. Oh... Pamela is gonna be upset. Well, he was really nice. Makes a change from all those customers yelling at me all day. I wonder what his name was though. I didn't even ask. You should know his name in case something happens. Oh, but he's an important character. All right, what's this challenge? Someone took your baskets. Hank will stop by with extras when he can, okay. I just wanna play the mini game ones because they're super fast and diamonds. Refill 10 baskets. I love how the challenge is no baskets. And now we're refilling baskets. Amber, I got you some souvenirs. What you got me? It's cute. It's wrapped so cute. Oh, a dress. Oh, uh, thanks. It's really pretty. Uh-oh, you hate it. <laughs> yeah. How do you do that? You read everyone like a book. It's called being a mother. He's back again. Well, I think that's my cue. Oh. Hi, I'm glad I got you, Amber. You can call me Clark, by the way. I wish I gave him a better voice. That seems rather fitting. You seem to travel quite a bit, Clark. Ah, uh, like Lewis and Clark. Clever. I'm sure you've heard it a thousand times. So how often do you travel for work? A lot. Like, really, a lot. That, actually, that sounds amazing. Actually, I'm kind of jealous. Wish I could get out of here. Well, you can. Anytime you like. I've got to get going. Hopefully our paths will cross again soon, Amber. Mm. David, though. You were just thinking about maybe you like David. Don't give up on him. Go on. 
sir. I know you didn't take everything out your pockets. Oh, the music's back. What happened last time? I was scared that it wasn't gonna have music again. <laughs> Well, let me refill these baskets. Alright, passport, hat, shoes, glasses. I literally just need one person. You're carrying keys and everything on you, aren't you? Again. You came in yesterday with your keys, a watch, and a lighter. Okay, that's a little better. You can forget about a watch in your pocket, but you can't forget about your keys and your camera. <laughs> like, you knew you had those on you. A lighter is like, oh, you know, my bad. Okay. You're gonna need to be detained as well. Come on over. I got the the mouseroo. Okay, you're gonna have that mini game. Fifty sixty. We yeah, got it. Well, let me stock this one thing. Somebody else will ask for a basket. I don't even really have to worry about it. Watch no one else ask for a basket and I'm just supposed to pick one up for fun. Goodbye. One star. Alright. You have to go through your stuff, sir. Oh, you're coming over here. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, what do we got? A watch. A camera and keys. You're out of control. You packed your stuff up too. Go drop your stuff off. Fifty. Oh, oh. Are you shifty eyes, McGee? My goal is to not have to restock the baskets for the rest of the day. All right. Goodbye. Three stars. Let me help you. Passport, eye mask, this thing, belt. Throw them in. You won't throw out enough stuff. You're gonna forget your camera in your pocket. As if you can't feel it. Oh, you're gonna need one of these, probably. On your neck. A lighter on your neck. Alright. You weirdo. <laughs> Are we cleared for the day? Thank you, everyone. Can I have a happy flight? A happy flight. Safe. <laughs> David! Our clerk somehow got our number. Oh, hey, Mom. Yeah, no, it's all going great. Still doing some training. 
Well, they aren't letting me fly out just yet. I need to learn a few more things first. Oh, hey, I met a man at the airport who complimented your taste. He said my name was pretty... Yeah, he was pretty cute. I know, I know. I know I should call you more. It's just been so busy lately. No, I know it's no excuse. I'll call more, I promise. Bye, Mom. I'm gonna have to tell her the truth eventually. Facts, Amber. Let's get out of this area and go where? We'll find out. What's this challenge? Play as Adrian. So play a regular day. Find a place to buy food for Amber's fish. In the... In the level? <laughs> good morning, Amber. How have you been? Clark, it's great to see you. I've been good, thanks. So where are you off to this time? Tahiti. There's a big humanitarian project. I'll be joining there for a little while. Amber! Sorry to interrupt, but we got a problem and I think you might be able to help. What's up? Well, we're short an employee in one of our VIP lounges. We'll need a replacement ASAP. Sure, no problem. Which VIP lounge is it? Tahiti. You need to be packed and ready to go right after your shift. <gasps> Sounds perfect. I've got it covered, Hank. Excellent. Sorry for the short notice, but I figured you might like a little adventure. So we're going to the VIP lounge. Sounds awesome. Thanks, Hank. Ah. Uh... Enthusiastic employees. What a coincidence. I guess we might end up seeing each other again pretty soon. That's great news. I really enjoy talking with you, Amber. Keep an eye out for you on the flight. He said he doesn't like being a VIP. But he's in the VIP lounge. She's so cute. Don't give up on David. Oh no! I need to buy food for sushi before I go. I'll have to search around for a pet store that'll ship it ASAP while I work. How'd you run out of food for your pet? Oh well, she might just be getting it shipped, Amazon and all. Oh my god, start these up. Go through, sir, I know you. Definitely. Keys, camera, and a watch. Fifty. Nine times out of ten, it's fifty. Once in a while, it'll be sixty. Let me stock real quickity quickity. Hey guys, I'm just gonna text right next to you when you're waiting. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got it. I'm loving this game so far, you guys. It's like, so fun. I love the speed. Everything's getting spooky fast. Sorry, I meant to check those all <laughs> out. It's cute. It's funny. 10 out of 10. I can't see it getting worse. Which is great. And on over. Plus, I would actually never want to work this job, but I like the game of it. Because, you know, I said in the beginning, I'm obsessed with airports. And airplane games. <laughs> I don't think I would like to work there in real life just because, I don't know, it's easier to play things. It just gets rid of all the bad parts about it. Sweet. Y'all yeah, right. About to hit one star. We got sushi some foods. Oh, that was supposed to be hard. Alright, you guys are good. A five pack of people. Goodbye. Number one. Mm hmm. Number two. 
Are you gonna do the same thing she did? <laughs> Need the same objects and everything? Three. Four. Fifty. Yes. Fives here. And there's one for the next batch. Thank you. Fifty? Fifty is the key, everyone. Hasn't failed me yet. Fifties failed me. Sixty. Oh my god. Fifty failed me so hard. But honestly, just check out these three people. Bye. Three stars. And we're almost closed. There's a couple of hooligans left. Late for their flight. You're super late, sir. I'm gonna need to be checked. Which one do you want? Oh, you're not getting a scanner? I thought there was enough hearts for that. Alright. Good to go. Thank you, sirs. Oh, yay! We got another thing in our diary. Tahiti! I can't believe it. This is amazing. Clark will be there too. He's so interesting. Oh. What's this? A note from David. Just wanted to say thanks for a great night. I love spending time with you. I think you're a wonderful person, Amber. Hope. P.S. Sleepy Amber's pretty adorable. Hey, David. Just found your note. Thanks. So I'm going to be traveling for a little while to Haiti. I thought she was just working in the lounge in the... She's going to Tahiti to work at that lounge? Or is she working in the lounge for the flight to Tahiti? Well, it's awesome you're traveling, but I do wish you were still around. Thanks, David. We'll have to plan another movie night when I get back. Sure. Well, I'd better get back to work. Have a safe trip, Amber. Thanks for everything, David. Well... Gotta hurry and feed sushi before I leave. Tahiti, here I come. And we got a journal entry. Did I not get the challenge? Do 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 do. My first flight. Oh, we are actually going to Tahiti with him. Dear Diary, today at security I met a cute guy. His name is Clark and he's a doctor. He's very nice. Hank was really stressed though because he was a member of staff short over at the VIP room. Turns out Hank wants to send me over to help. But guess where this VIP room is? In Tahiti. And guess who's going to who's also going to Tahiti? Sexy Clark. I hope we can grab some time to talk together. I'm leaving tonight. I can't wait. She's so cute. Oh, adjust the seats. Oh, so we're going on the flight? No, we're working in the lounge. Oh, I guess we're adjusting the seats in the lounge. That makes sense. What can we get with our diamonds? Nothing. I'm too poor. Oh my god, I need 10. I'm gonna have to get on these challenge levels. <laughs> Next part, we're going to the lounge. Going to Tahiti. And, um, the black girl's there. There's Clark's body. There's some guy. I don't know. 
Maybe that's David. Maybe David works in Tahiti. That'd be ridiculous. Anyway, enough speculation. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you so, so much. Goodbye.